Hey guys, just want to share something with you. Um, today we kind of added on the sonar to the leg. I I know I posted it, but I haven't shown you guys what it actually does. So this is on a pulley system that commonly will be tilted up when you're running. I mean, it doesn't have to be, but I would say get it away from the prop. It doesn't rest in front of the prop. I mean, you probably could leave it that way and be fine. It does pivot up. So I'm assuming if you're running, it probably would be just fine. Anyway, so what I did is I put a system in, in it together here to be able to pull this thing up and down at will. I do think I'm going to probably put another pulley on it, but all stainless steel that runs down the side with a handle. Of course, this handle is going to go right up in here. I can lock it in the position to keep that leg up. Now, I haven't kind of got my wire management where I need it yet. I think I'm going to flip the wires around. But um, so what's going to happen is this. So as you pull it up, of course, and it works great. Pull it up you just have to keep that motor straight but you don't have to because this will swivel um but yeah that's kind of what we're up against so i'm gonna show you the front of this real quick so so this basically gets us in our vertical position up away from the engine and like i said right here i think it's a binding point but i think i'm gonna put something right here something that's permanent because i don't use that for my motor anyway so over here check out this rig so what i did is i got sick of buying well, I'm not sick of buying. I don't want to buy a whole, whole new setup. So I'm using DeWalt batteries, or kind of a fake DeWalt battery, um, with a block on top. So I'm basically taking a 20 volt down to 12 volts and running my system. And you'll see the sonar is on now. And um, nice part about this, it's plug and play. No space, I can run extra switches, extra lights, you know, depending on what you want to put in here. So it actually works really well. You slide it over, close it, close it. I got a couple switches in there. I can run more on that side if I wanted to, but you'll see it's all hot swappable. Still have one more circuit available. And then on the back of this, like I said, you got basically unplugged, and that's pretty much it. Everything else is run on the side. I may run this in the boat at some point. Not a big fan of it, but uh, I like being able to take my things off. So that's it. You'll see on the side. I'll give you guys a little side profile here. You'll see up here, basically just pulls up. The rotation of the engine has nothing to do with this because it's actually attached to the center of the drive tube so it goes with it um we'll see how that angle works down there it is a little bit off plane i think i'm not sure i may have to bend the pipe a little bit but um again this can go all the way back just not sure if i need to do that so i could run this literally on par with the engine it's going to pull up anyway so i guess it's going to be a Let's see and wait until we actually try it. But nice part about it is that it does, it does come off. If you don't want it, you just pull it off. No big deal. I'm trying to make it to where you don't have to run it if you don't want to. Just take it off. And uh, most likely this will not be run inside of a D-Link or anything like that. It'll be kind of free-forming so I can just drop it when I don't want to use it. And kind of I made it to where it would fit right in here. So I can just wrap it, loop it, and kind of keep that up here. And then it kind of holds itself. You don't have to worry about it. So... There's my rig. You'll kind of see everything in place here, but I will kind of tidy up everything down here to make sure everything kind of moves. I think I'm gonna change my kill switch to the other side. I think I'm gonna run this one down the middle. I haven't quite got there yet. There we go. So it is on running a fake DeWalt battery, which you guys will see. It works good though at six amp hour. Can't beat the price. And there you go. There's the Pursuit rigged out.